Hello beauties, my name is Eva and this is second and the last makeup for St. Patrick's Day. This time let's do something more artistic. This makeup is really easy, so don't be afraid to give it a try. I've already started by doing base of my face. I'm going to use paints, so I like to prepare my face for this and make it flawless like a canvas. Now I'm applying my foundation. I'm going also to apply P. Louise Base, Matte Beige Eyeshadow to set my whole eyelids, concealers, powders, brow gel just to make my brows more visible and bronzer to give my face a little dimension. For this makeup you're gonna need some colorful paints, I'm going to use all rainbow colors from Meron Paradise Palette water activated paints, but believe me with only eyeshadows you're also able to do it. I'm taking purple and I'm starting to paint my, let's call it, rainbow braid. Next stripes will be under this purple, so the next is blue. You can absolutely do it with just eyeshadows, but it's gonna take you more time. You'll have to pack those shades to achieve perfect pigmentation. With paints it's just easier. After blue I'm adding also a stripe of light blue and then I'm taking green. Next stripe is more lime and another one yellow. Now orange and the last one red. Don't bother with perfection. This makeup is so colorful, just have some fun! I'm taking shade Wasted from Be Perfect Cosmetics Carnival XL Pro Palette in collaboration with Stacey Murray and I'm setting my purple stripe. Also, I'm blending this shade down onto blue stripe to a little blend the edges. Now just Carnival Palette and shade Sky and the same technique. I'm setting blue stripe and blend this eyeshadow around onto purple but mostly onto light blue and even green stripe. Carnival XL Pro shades the Hype and Ecstasy to set green stripe and to blend with colors under the green. Now I'm adding more mango slash honey yellow and setting it with shade Keen from Carnival palette. Then I take also color Quench from Jeffree Star Cosmetics Thirsty palette. Technique is still the same, to set stripe and to blend with colors around. Now I'm taking shade Kiss Me by Melchior. This is one of the prettiest true red that I have in my collection. Rainbow is done, it's time for pot of gold. I'm taking black paint and starting with the contour. I want my lips to be this gold and my chin will be pot. I'm filling the pot but not with full pigmentation. Here I want perspective, so I keep one side of the pot darker and other side lighter. Now with gold paint I'm covering my lips and paint a pile of gold above my lips and on Cupid's bow. I'm going back to black paint and adding handle to the spot. Now it's time for white. I'm adding details on lighter side of the pot, so these are light reflects. I'm taking gold metallic shade by Melchior to set gold paint. To add more details and dimension, I'm adding gold eyeliner, dazzle liner in shade Klimt by Nabla. I'm just drawing lines, dots, just something to make a pattern. White details! I'm starting with little twinkling stars. Look closely. I'm drawing one long vertical line, then a little short horizontal, then oblique short lines like little cross on this big one. And there you go! I'm drawing them in very random places and in a random amount. The last white details are dots. Just dots everywhere where you want. To make dots I'm using tip of the handle of the brush, but if you want smaller dots great option is dotting nail tool. Meanwhile I changed white paint for a white liquid lipstick Drug Lord by Jeffree Star Cosmetics, but I forgot to show it. Jeffree's white lipstick is my favorite stuff for white details. 
At the end I decided to add 4 leaf clover on the pot using gold eyeliner. Draw 4 hearts and that's it! I'm not super proud of this makeup because I see a lot, a lot of mistakes, but after all I had fun and by the end of the day this is something that is the most important. I hope you have a lot of fun while doing this makeup and I hope you had fun while watching this video. In the next video I have no idea what will be next, so we shall see. So as always, I love you very very much and I see you soon. Bye!